Hey. Happy Sunday. Here for another episode of Purchase or Pass with Shorty C94. What's up, what's up, what's up? Yo. Nah, you know. What's up? You know, what's up, what's up, what's up? Mm-hmm. I feel like you're trying to be funny, but it's cool. Um, so this is my first time back on Purchase or Pass. I've been out yeah, the last weeks, two, you know, like two episodes. Big Al Kicks, for, you know what I'm saying, being my uh, special guest host in your uh, absence. Yeah. Yeah, so one Sunday I was sick, and then last Sunday I was traveling um, on my way to Vegas, so I couldn't hop on, but I did catch a little bit when I had my little layover at the airport. It was uh, nice seeing you and you and Al. Thanks, Al, for stepping in for me. Appreciate you. All right. So what is today? The 15th, 16th? I'm all discombobulated because it's snowing here. Like, I'm not a fan. Like, <laughs> you know I'm not a fan. Like. I even pulled out some sneaker boots today and wore some sneaker boots because it's legitimately snowing and been snowing. It just stopped snowing Look, like 30 lie. minutes ago. Well, Vianca, you can tell them. I was going to break out some boots too, but it was too cold, man. <laughs> I ain't got no boots in the house, so like, man, fuck it, man. You know, just wear some React Visions, you know, we're going to just basically be around the house anyway, so. Oh, yeah, I'm not going anywhere. And honestly, yeah. there's nowhere to go. Everything is closed. Like, it snowed, and, like, they sh shut the whole – it feel like the whole state I'm hoping down. it's like this tomorrow, too, so Charlotte too, I can watch uh, some of these games, you know, since it's MLK Day, so. Good luck. So, with that, I feel like January yeah, always has been a slow is, month man. for sneakers. Yeah. Yeah. So we usually start reflecting back on the previous week. Um, I did not buy anything that dropped. <laughs> like I didn't try for anything. We didn't just... neither one of us tried for those fours. Um and even before that, neither one of us tried audio for those thirteen. Can you hear No, nah, I right, cut it off before we even Are you started. on the Wi Fi? I thought I was doing something good. Oh Lord. Shot this. I use that later. All right, can you hear me? Yeah, yeah. yeah Yandra, can, you, can you, hear you hear me? Okay. So, um, the, I mean, we talked about the last week. The red fours, the red thunder fours was Jake. Doesn't really fuck with him. They just weren't something I needed to have, especially not at that price point. <laughs> I said your mom moving like the Chinese movie. <laughs> yeah, it might be it's like hey, but you scram. <laughs> oh man, that is hilarious. Um yeah, it, it may be the snow, but as we all know, his oh, phone's we're on the same janky, plan. so no telling it's about Verizon or. plan. I don't know why your phone is so much better than mine, even though it's the same phone. Yeah. You may need to um turn that in, see yeah. if they AJ, can replace your phone. I think it's your phone. Jake Pinkett 6. Not necessarily I, I still be saying service. Jake down here. People be like, what the fuck is this nigga talking about? Jake, what the fuck, what the fuck is that? But I still be talking like... I got to explain to everybody at, at, at Converse what Jake means. I'm like, man, that shit, Jake. You know, so, yeah. They know now, though. Yeah. So, that's not even just a regional thing. That's also, like, a time thing, because people don't... Like, hey, niggas in Cleveland still say... 
damn, she said it's lame. Hey, I'm, I'm always going to say Jake and Weak and Whack and all that. Mm -hmm. All right. So, no recent cops. Um, well, we bought some, but none of the hot releases. Like, I just bought um, a pair of Furiosas that they added to just the regular Nike site. Um, they're pink, purple, and like a sea moss kind of green and white. Um, no, nah, he's not coming down here with me. Mm -mm. Oh, Jay Pink is six, says I say Jake too. <laughs> yeah, that's funny. Um, did you buy anything? You I got some reach back, did you? Finally, but nah, no. Yeah, some reachbacks, but nothing new. Okay. Yeah, the Furiosas I saw, I saw them on the end uh, website. They've been on the end website for like two, three months now. And they just put them on the regular Nike site. So I bought those. So um, that was, that's it. I haven't bought anything else new since the, what was the last thing I got? The LeBrons? Yeah, and those craft uh, ones. Yeah. Yep, that was it. All right, so January is slow, continues to be slow. The sneakers app looks sad. I've never seen it look like that <laughs> in terms of releases. Like, one day I looked up, pulled up the sneaker app, and it was like three shoes on there. I'm like, what is this? Like, it's a lot of days when we get three shoes in one day. So, I don't know. It's very, very odd. So, um, there's nothing releasing today and nothing releasing tomorrow, which tomorrow is MLK Day. Um, so there's nothing coming out. And then on Tuesday, January 18th, we have two shoes coming out. There is the Nike Air Max Pre-Day Warm Core. Um, the Pre-Day has been out for a little while. I've yet to see a colorway that I really, really need or want to have. Um, the purple ones caught my attention, but... Um, warm like core. What color blue, is that? I can't remember. What they look like, and, you know, it's a decent colorway. Tan. But uh, yeah, yeah, nothing I have to have. And then the Nike Air Jordan One Mid Black Particle Gray and Red. So those are coming out on Tuesday. Again, nothing I need to have. They're not even going to be on sneakers. Those are just going to be on the regular you Nike app. Uh, releasing them. at 10, so <laughs> Eastern. Said you know they don't give a fuck about them. You said what? They do, because all the men's keep selling out, so they care. <laughs> it's so it's people know, out there that wear kids. What's up, B-Man216? Nah, I'm saying Nike. You know what I mean? They just kind of like, whatever, we just throw these out, you know, give them the regular Nike, see what we do, but you know, they ain't put it's and and, and OG high is on regular Nike, so. Yeah. yeah. Oh, thanks, Selena. Yeah, just got these mm -hmm. done. I love having my hair braided because I hate doing my hair. I'm not really like a do hair type of person, <laughs> so I love having my hair braided. So I have to worry. I love about having it, too because I ain't got a hair. I was excited it. to get these. Whatever. Anyway. Um, the 19th, so that's Wednesday, we have the Adidas Forum Low Black Yeah, it was supposed to come out last week, Is that a it got shoe? pushed uh, back to this week. Uh, remember how I was going to get those triple platform high top forms? We were at uh, Smithfield, you know, they had like the three soles on it. What's up, Easy Does It? Yeah, I don't really remember. Um, but yeah, it's like literally three form bottoms on, on one. I mean, if you want, I can get a pair of your forms here and mm -hmm. show the people what it is. You know what I mean? Mm, that's okay. But, um, no, that's not something I need to have. And then the women's Nike Dunk High Up in black and white is coming up. I don't really care for the um, high ups. They've had a few colors come out. They had a pink pair, um, like a green pair, some other colors, a red one or something. So now they got black and white coming up. Um, it's a women's only shoe, but again, it's just, it's not something I need to have. Um, these are 125. Um, and they're, I believe they're coming out on just a regular Nike app, not on sneakers. 
So I'll be passing on yeah. those. You know. <laughs> All right. So on January 20th, uh, we have the Nike Space Hippie 4 in white. There's a women's one. I Not forgot to put on the list. It's have. like gray and blue and pink. But it's just for women. It looks like ladder KD4 or okay. KD5, but whatever. Um, I don't see you fucking with the Space Hippie. I mean, when I got my first pair, right when we moved here, um, you wasn't fucking with them then either. So, you know. Yeah. I hear they're comfortable. I, I need to try them on. There was one pair I considered getting. They were like a sale color um, that I thought would have been cute for like spring or something. So, I don't know. Nothing I really have to have. Um, then we got three pairs of Nike Air Jordan 1 low golf shoes. They're coming in shadow, all white, and then wolf gray. So the shadow, of course, is black and gray. Um, all white and then a wolf gray color. Um, I don't yeah. golf, so pass it on all three. Um, releasing on sneakers, the Nike LeBron 9 South Coast. Also, we'll be passing on those. Um, nines are good. I just, I don't, like this colorway, I don't have to have them. And are you, you know, going to try for these? You remember, I mean, we were together with the nine. No? Came out. I fuck with the nine. You know this, but nah, man. I mean, I remember when those yeah. uh, first came out, like, it's just not a good colorway. I mean, I'm still hurt that I don't have the Watch the Thrones. I feel like that's a shoe I should have. But I, I don't really have any interest in these. These would be one of them where, oh, it's next door at Nike. You know, that was, well, my discount, that was, uh, you know, $150 or something. It would be like that. You know what I mean? Like, I'd pay $150, but I'm not paying 210 on release day. Yeah. Um, yeah, I'll say he likes the colors on the South Coast. Yeah, I like the colors, too. Um but for some, I don't know why. Like, it's just not a shoe that I feel like I need to have. Like, old me probably would have wanted I'll, them, but the price point. If the know, swoosh was just, pink, it, doesn't seem worth it, it would me. even be different, but they're just not raw. They're just... That would be too much. Like, not the, the South, South Beach, Beach 9, the maybe. Pink. You know what I mean? Like, but nah, they're, they're just not raw. Like, I, I hate to say it. I love the 9, but they're just not raw. Okay. Then the last re release for the 20th is the Nike Kyrie 7 um, Sneaker Room Collab Mom Pack. Um, so there are two pairs. So one set, um, there's one green shoe and one yellow shoe. And then the other set, there's one red shoe and one blue shoe. Um, I like them. Uh, they're very colorful. Um I have a few pairs of the seven. I like the seven. It's comfortable. Um, there are actually a couple more pairs of uh, Kyrie sevens that I would like to get. Don't know what's going on with the eight. We know there was a lot of controversy before when they were well, talking about releasing the eight. The so we'll see. So um, yeah, the eight. It's released just to call the infinity. I mean, infinity is eight. Is that an eight then? I think it's because of whatever happened. But the thing that sucks about these shoes is that they're both limited. There are more of the green and yellow pair. I think it's 1,996 pairs made because um, it's in honor of his mother and his, and his sister. The red and blue pair is only like 500 or so made. So, I mean, these are going to be L's all around anyway. Um, oh, yeah. All the Kyries look the same. They're just like the new Kobe's. Like, I just... I don't know. I, I hate to say it. I like the idea. It's money. It's a charity shoe, so it's raising money. You know, it's, it's a good thing, but I, I ain't got to have either of these. Yeah. Um, I, I like them. I would try to get them. If they were like a, I wouldn't even say a general release, just more easily available, I would try to get them. But I don't see myself jumping through hoops trying to um, obtain a pair of these shoes. If they released on sneakers, I would enter the draw, you know, and just see what happens. But I'm not putting forth effort to try to get them. But I do like how they came Shout out. Shout out to everybody who just they joined. They were cute to me. Welcome. 
All right. So the 21st, we have a lot of Reeboks coming out. Uh, but first, there's a New Balance 990 V5 vegan. No? Yeah. Passing. They're all, well, me too. let me hold my comments for later. Yeah, I'm passing. All right, and then there's, what, five pairs of Reeboks Out that are supposed time. to be coming out? So there's two. <laughs> um, there's two pairs of Bape collabs. So there's an Instapump Fury and a Club C. Well, nope. Instapumps are all right. But Not doing it. The cost, I'm cool. Yeah, that's the thing for me. Like, and I'm really not even like into bait like that where I like, oh, I need to have like no, I'm cool on both of those. Um there's also a rebar question. Now, if that was a mid alive question, with color. I would fuck with it. Like oh, oh even you now, if this was a mid, you, yeah. you probably would mess with it. I would, but Yeah, I'm I might mess with I mean, it, 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 it could the outlet. You know what I mean? And see so look at Al, it's the pumps with the uh, <laughs> nah, but, uh, <laughs> yeah, nah, nah, not on those. And then, you know, there's a, a kamikaze that is colored exactly the same called the 96 All-Star. Mm -hmm. It's also a pass. Yeah. Yeah, pass on those two. And then there's a yeah, Reebok it's, it's answer based off for of, um, the tunnel. There was one time, I think it was in the 01 finals when they were playing the Lakers, where he walked through the, the tunnel and he had on a, a Eagles jersey. So it's white and green is eagles colored uh he had an eagles jersey but it was for him it said iverson mm -hmm. on the back so you know it's an answer for for that i mean that's a nice idea i would also get that at the outlet but i wouldn't like be buying it like pay real money yeah so we'll check out the outlet in about 90 days um, 60 days <laughs> see what they have um 60 days, yeah, yeah, up, yeah. Boy, long, what's up, Jay Van? Game crazy. Oh, folk. All right, so a lot of stuff coming out on the 22nd. Um, I'm gonna start at the bottom of the list, a bunch of Nike stuff. So there's a Nike Air Flight Light 2 in uh, white and red. This was a Pippin and PE. Yeah, when the bitches go on sale, you messing with it. You know, if I'm able my swoosh account were they like $72 or something like that? Yeah. But I ain't not, not for them. Like, nah. Yeah. Um, there is a Nike Air Max 90 um air oh, sprung. It basically looks like a fake ass version of them one nineties nope. you got with like the pull tab, kind of a trail looking joints, like fake ass version of that. So what's up, Struggle? Mm -hmm. My next guest is Shorty Sneaky Conversations. But yeah, nah. Nah. No. Nah. All right. So then they got two pairs of women's dunks, low next nature dunks. So these use the recycled materials. There's a white and red pair and a white and gray pair. Um, I might try for the white and red pair, but I don't even need to have those. <laughs> Honestly, I don't need either one of those. So I'll probably pass on both. Here that you um, have. And I. I'm assuming you're not interested know. in either of those. Either. And I got the white red high tops. I mean, they're from 2003, but they're still sufficient. I mean, uh, what's up, Ash? Yeah. Nah, I, I, don't, I don't even see you really fucking with the white red uh, lows. Like, you ain't ever gonna wear nothing like that. No, I'm not. Yeah, I'm passing on both of those. I don't need those. Um, Nike Air Trainer yeah, Coriander. Uh, the Trainer One. They've kind of retooled nice. it and made it a little more uh, rugged. Um, so yeah, I mean, that might be a game time decision. Hey, Ash, thank you for sending me all them LeBron links. I really appreciate it. You know, like I, I really do. And broke, don't cop. <laughs> oh man. But yeah. Um, nah. Okay. Then the Nike Air Blazer Low Sakai collab in white and gray is supposed to come out on the 22nd. What's up, um, JG? Allegedly. Eight. Not something I need to have. I don't really, I haven't really um, tried to, I haven't tried to get any of those low blazers. I mean, think about collabs. it. You know, since, again, since I'm a Nike employee, I've had chances to get multiple pairs of them 
the other colors. Like, I just don't like the bitches. I don't like low top blazers, man. And I'm not, you know, I just, I don't like them. Like, I wish they would come out with more LD waffles in these different colors and they just keep pouring out this blazer. You know, I just, you know, make them hot top or don't make them at all, man. I just, I don't like it, you know. I think those shoes would look weird. I, hit hot top hot top. Blazer I don't know before. how much I would like them. They need to just stop. Yeah. Mm. I mean, mid, high. They weren't I mid. Mean, to me, that's not really that much difference in a, a blazer, but, you know, something that's not a low top. But, yeah, I just, I don't like them. Okay. I'll be passing on those. And then, then uh, Nike Air Jordan 1 platform Air and white and right gray there. is supposed to come out. <laughs> no, thank you. <laughs> yeah, she did say she wanted those. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna hit her up and see if she get those. Right, right. But yeah, the that's not for me. I'm not really. I don't wear platform oh. shoes. Really, that's not a thing for me. So oh, I'll be passing on those for sure. Um, the Nike Air Jordan 14 particle gray, not something I, I need like to you. have. Gear wear. Jordans that you would get on 147th at Harvard. You know what I'm saying? Not dare to wear. What is wrong? Hey, I don't know if you're aware of the Cleveland. They used to sell fake Jordans that were all in the east side of Cleveland. You know, they, they had fake DMP packs and everything, man. They, they would get, and they would have like crazy colored Jordans too. But yeah, they, they look like that. Like, nah. If it's, it's a 14 and it's not the white, black, and red, that's the only one I, I need at this point. A newer pair. I'm cool. Okay. All right. And then probably the highlight of the week, uh, the Adidas Yeezy Boost 350 V2. Blue tint is restocking. I will be passing yeah, on Luga those as well. And the blue tint and the, the, um, the zebra are the three, uh, 350 V2s that I wish I had. Um, I don't know, man. I mean, it's like... Having other 350s, it's like these bitches don't really matter. I know that they matter, but they don't matter. I only wanted the Beluga because it was the first 350 V2. And, you know, I was in the heat of the battle, you know, working for Next uh, with all the easy shit. So that brings back some memories. But these don't hold the same. They're one of the better colors, but nothing I have to have uh, either. I'd rather find a used pair from 2017 or 18 than get a new pair. Well, it depends how much they resell it for. Let me take that back. I was just about to say, you gonna pay more for a new pair? I mean, for a used pair than the trying yeah. kit? You were really sitting the there, and I was like, that doesn't make any sense to me. For this much, you know, so. But yeah, I mean, I'm, I don't know, man. I kind of feel the same way I feel about the Ultra Boost, about the Easy, man. Like, it's, it's like over with, man. Like, what else can you do? Now they bring it back to old shit, because they can't really. I mean, you got multiple Yeezys behind me here. You ain't even really wore, like, you know, yourself, so. one one of them but yeah i mean the the yeezys is not a shoe that um has been important to me personally so i don't have many pairs and i've not even tried to get many pairs um the first pair that i actually wanted and tried to get i did get those those mx oats um, there's a blue version of that that's supposed to be coming out that I will probably try to get, but yeah, this is not something I have to have, but it, yeah. it's definitely the highlight of the week. Like, there's not much else. Hey, so you know, if you're still in here, much, go ahead honestly. and sprinkle some of that uh, magic uh, Yeezy dust where you hit all the shit on the confirmed. You know what I'm saying? Sprinkle some of that stuff. That's else, you know, some of that. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's crazy. So, recap it for the week. The only thing, yeah, there's nothing I'm gonna try to get on here. It's nothing. What about? I'm, what I'm, trying to get to get man. I'm just wait tip? out. I'm trying to wait out the pippins until they either go on the swoosh for cheap or if Jimmy Jazz or I was about to say City Blue, like we're back at home. Jimmy Jazz or DTLR, or somebody have them for the cheap. You know. Um, that's really the only thing that interests me. I know I sound mm -hmm. like an old head just wanting the old shoe, but ain't ain't nothing else, man. 
So, yeah. Yeah, there's there's nothing on here I'm going to try to get. I mean, like I said, those Kyries, I like them. Um, and, you know, Kyrie has a special place in my heart. Uh, always has, always will. But I'm not about to put forth the effort to try to get those. So, like I said, if they were releasing on sneakers and I could just enter a draw and it'd be easy, I would do that. But I'm not jumping through hoops to try to get those. But, yeah, that's that's pretty much it. Like, there's nothing coming out, which is good for my pockets, right? What's up, Jackson? Yeah. I mean, yeah. I'm out there trying to run that distance, but I don't see them flying off the shelf either. So, a lot of that shit. Yeah. They might. Um, surprise, I mean, just more stuff sells out than it used to, right? So they may sell out, but they're not something that I need to have. I did like them when I saw them. I thought they were nice, but I'm, again, also, I'm not putting my effort like, to try to get them. It was to sell out online, but they won't sell out in the store. So, like, if that store is sitting, you know, if it's down here in social mm-hmm. status or it's back at home at Next or Villa or or wherever, you know, um, but you know, I can be more direct to consumer here lately, so I'm just imagining my sneakers like that, so you never know, so I want sneakers, so. Yeah. Yeah, 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 so all right well that's it so let's tell the people what we got coming up this week tomorrow i am doing episode three of lady sneaker conversations featuring uh dope chicks with kicks ash mcmath 04 and kicks for fresh and that is at what it's seven o'clock seven o'clock tomorrow live on <laughs> i was trying to remember what time it was scheduled for but it's scheduled for seven Uh, So episode three, really excited about that. Looking forward to having some conversations about all things sneakers tomorrow. What do you got coming? You got a lot of stuff coming up over the next couple weeks. I'll be at Converse less and less. But um, so on Tuesday, we're supposed to uh, have a tentative, a couple of tentative dates. Uh, Tuesday, we're supposed to uh, do Shorty Sneaker Conversations episode 63. But the struggle continues. 22. Um, tentative date for Thursday with uh, P Kicks 23. Patrick Broussard. He's somebody I actually did my first sneaker battle with uh, at some point last year. I mean, I, I won. But, you know, um, and then on Saturday, I'm part of the Who Has the Heat YouTube uh, sneaker battle for money. So I need all y'all to tune in on Saturday after 7 and vote for your boy. You know what I mean? I'm going up against Coffee with the foe. Uh, hopefully I'll uh, come out victorious and go to the next round so I can win this money to just buy more sneakers. <laughs> um, also uh, in a couple weeks, sneaker you're doing podcast, the, I forgot about um, that. Yeah, that. I think it's on the 28th. Not, it's not and this, then, it's like you know, next week, right? Still got reachbacks. January edition with the QC Kiki Kiki. She had the comments. She keeps talking about, I sound like I'm underwater. I sound like a robot. You know what I mean? So, you know, definitely one of my favorite collectors. If y'all don't follow her, follow QC Kiki Kiki. Um, but yeah, um, so that'll be before the month ends. Uh, what's up, T. Marsh? He's also in the, the battle. Uh, but yeah, so that's that's the whole thing. You know, but more than anything else, loving on you. What? What did you say? What did you say?
I don't even remember, but it's fine. All right. So um, thank you, everybody, for tuning in. Uh, we will see you next Sunday for another episode of Purchase or Pass. We may be in the same room next Sunday because I'm about sick of this. Um, you went out. I think you said somebody was calling you or something. Like, I don't, I don't know. But if, I mean, I can hear you fine, but it's always something with your audio. Like, I don't understand. <laughs> and we'll really see what's going on when we check out the uh, the playback right quick. So we'll see. But next Sunday, we'll be back for another episode of Purchase or Pass. Please tune in to our various uh, IG lives throughout the week. Um, we thank you for your um, time and joining us today. Happy Sunday. And everybody have a good week. And hopefully, if you're off tomorrow for MLK Day, you'll either relax or be able to partake in some sort of community service. So, all right, everyone. Thanks so much. Have a great week.